Social media f- up though. Yeah. Everything. Marriages. At first, your bitch used to just see <laughs> the n- that work. <laughs> you and that's it. Then come on. <laughs> now she got about 30,000 n- to look at. But when you don't act right. It's not the internet, it's you. It's what you what you pushing in you. You know what I'm saying? The, the beast that you feed within yourself is what's causing all these problems to happen. You sitting around being lustful, you got a home life going on, and you you using the internet to be lustful instead of getting off their phone and get in tune with what's going on in your house and make that a happy place. You know what I'm saying? There's too many people in their home thinking outside of their home, man. There's too many people in these homes that letting too many voices outside of the home be louder than the voice that's in the home. Man, y'all got to catch on to what's going on, man. When you got a household, when you got a home dynamic, man, charity starts at home, man. Whatever somebody else got going on in their life, whatever going on in the world, man, you shouldn't be bothered about it, man, because that's not your reality. See, our problem is we falling for too many illusions, man. We always want something to happen fast, that quick gratification. And that's what's killing the black people, man. Are y'all understanding it's not the internet because we the one creating these profiles. We the one getting out here following certain people. We the one that's liking and loving these videos and promoting certain negative behavior. Promoting on the Jezebel spirit, man. Promoting pimping. Promoting robbing, man. Promoting killing. You know what I'm saying? Promoting, man, backdooring people, man. Are y'all understanding it's deeper than rap, man? You know what I'm saying? Because time and time again, man, we see the jealousy. We see the deceit. We see people looking at these certain people's social media pages and saying hateful comments. Hey, look at this. Hating on the people, man. It start with your mind, man. If you don't have a positive mind frame and if you ain't trying to stand on what's right in this world, man, you're going to fall to the wayside every time. You're going to fail, man. You know what I'm saying? They got us so trapped up in the internet that people get on there. You have a problem at home. You go to certain people's pages. Oh, this person look good. This person said what I like to hear. I'm looking at this person's pictures. Now I feel like this person is a better person than the person I got at home. Not even caring about this person being there for me. This person helped me do this and that. This person was really down for me for real. People do not care about that, man. Y'all have to understand that this world have changed. And then for me, being the age that I am, man, and the things that I went through in life from before the internet came out and seeing the internet now, when I started seeing all that messiness and that confusion on the internet, I knew I didn't want no parts of it. You know what I'm saying? All that DMing and all this shit, I never sent a DM to anyone a day in my life and never will. You know what I'm saying? Because of the simple fact, I would rather meet a person face value head on. I want to see your emotions, your reactions. I don't want no illusion. I want the truth, dog. And a lot of people don't understand, man, on the internet, they can tell you anything, man. But I'd like for you to be certain. I want to be for sure. When you tell me something, I want to be able to, I, I want to be able to take that to the bank, man. You know what I'm saying? If something ain't clear cut and dry to me, man, I ain't believing it. I'm riding on what I believe. And that's what's getting y'all, man, that follower mentality. Y'all don't have no belief system within you where you strong enough and built up that if this person say, okay, let's do this. You can't just be like, man, I'm cool. I'm straight. Y'all go ahead. See, a lot of us too weak, man. You know what I'm saying? By you staying weak-minded, you going to easily be swayed into the wrong direction, man. You going to easily be swayed and led into something that once you get in it, you going to be like, man, I'm left out with a thought up front. But our people, we got hindsight and not foresight. And that's what's killing us. And then you, after something go wrong with you, you want to go cry on people's shoulders, lie on folks and this and that. But man, the internet done corrupt a lot of us, man. I done seen it time and time again, man. A lot of people lose a good thing, man. Chasing their gratification on that internet, man. Taking pictures. Everybody, all the females black taking pictures. They got to turn around, show their ass. They got to t- have a shirt with the cleavage all out. That's their idea of beauty, man. They don't love for real. They want you to love a body, man. They don't even want you to know who they are inside because they going to hold so many secrets from you. They not even going to open up to you, man. They going to deal with you according to what you like. They going to keep dressing themselves up, putting their makeup, nails, and stuff like that on. And the illusion is created with the man, man. They lust for desires that you got. Now you a Jezebel. You feel me? You feel me? Then a female, they so cold with the game, man. They following all these guys. They already know who they going to deal with next. They sizing they man up. Goddamn, trying to put this man at a higher pedestal than they man. 
and just don't know, baby. It can be all an illusion. You don't know what's really going on. You just know it sounded look good to you, baby. You got to wake up to the game, man. Life is real, man. Y'all got to get back to the core existence of life, man. Stop giving what they putting down to y'all, man. Stop looking for how life go through this internet. I heard so many women in my lifetime try to tell people how a man should be a man. How would you be able to tell a man to be a man? And most of you women not even being real women, man. Y'all not being nurturer, man. A lot of these women done turned into dudes. It be just like kicking it with your homeboy, kicking with some of these girls, man. And you know, I just hope we can get back to the core is this is a life, man. Just like Finesse two times said about the girl, man, you on there hollering about, bro. And I, my men don't want to hurt it, man. We don't want to hurt no woman. A woman should be graceful, man. And I don't care what made you not be that way and this and that. As a woman, you should just have it in your, you should want to walk with grace. See, and that's another thing. People always got to see where the men did. No, if you be a woman walking with grace, a man that like a woman with grace going to come for you, man. If you a woman out here trying to act like a street john on thugging and all that, we looking at you like a piece of meat. So don't confuse yourself in your head to think that you more than what you are, man. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's the thing, man. We so, we so delusional, bro. That's what's killing me about nobody don't have a brain. That's why the internet winning. Cause they get the, the desires in their heart. Can't nobody suppress them. Can't nobody fight their desires, man. It's real spiritual warfare and I paid attention in my life. Out of everybody did something to me wrong, man. I don't even view it as being that person, man. It's that spirit in that person. Because I saw good and bad out of everybody I done been in contact with, man. But it's just certain things that I never forget. You know what I'm saying? Certain things that I never look over. But at the end of the day, you know, I ain't gonna treat that person different or nobody different, but it'll never be the same because I know what I know. You know what I'm saying? And see, a lot of people don't realize, man, you know, that life is real, man. You know what I'm saying? Emotions are real and feelings are real, man. And then some people just don't know and don't have the idea of what love really means, man. That's really the problem. That's why the internet is causing so much stuff to fail because it wasn't no real love there in the first place, man. Unconditional love. And a lot of people getting in relationships and they not looking at it for the long haul. They looking at the relationship for some some short-term gratification, some short-term prospering of what they can get out of the next person. Men and women, because men do it to women as well as far as trying to get what they can get out of a man. A person looking at the internet or watch your whole life, see how you move, see how you operate, and then in their mind, they feel like they know how to come to you. See all this stalker mentality, man. See, to me, it's a lot of weirdo this to the internet. I look at it like a weirdo arena, man. Because I'm not finna chase and follow behind looking at nobody like that. I don't even know. Now, if you come up on the live feed and your pictures ain't right, but I'm not finna be going deep indulging into nobody that I don't know, man. I want to learn all that face value so I can know if I can believe you or not. I don't believe the pictures. That we have to take some accountability for our actions, man. For the steps we take and for the moves we make. You know what I'm saying? Things that go on in our life, man. Pick that mirror up and look at yourself. Because anything that happened in your life, that was your fault, man. Because you had an opportunity to get to the fork in the road and go right. It ain't nobody else's fault you made that left, man. So all them giving us a crutch, giving us a scapegoat, saying that this is the reason this happened or this is why this happened. Man, it started with the people, man. It's you. You know what I'm saying? Because it's what you indulging in. It's what you putting your time in. It's what you putting your mental into, man. Them lustful desires and that Jezebel spirit. That's what's killing us, man. Wake up, people.